<laughs> well, howdy, partner. What can I get you? I'll have an orange juice, please, partner. Must have been a rough day if you're going straight to the rough stuff, mister. And if you don't mind me saying, you look oddly familiar. Maybe you just look like someone I know. No, no, I, I've seen you before. You're always in here alone, ain't you? Why are you always alone, mister? Don't you have any friends? Well, that's a complicated question, but uh, I guess I could answer it with a story. Mister, what, what are you doing? Huh? Oh, uh, sorry, I was going into a flashback. I, I was going to tell you the story through flashback, if that's okay. Uh, that's new, but uh, sure. Yeah, go ahead. All right, where was I? Oh, yeah. Uh, I can tell you through a story. You see, there used to be a time when I'd try and make friends. Found myself in the sticks one day and figured I'd try to integrate with the locals. Howdy, mister. I said howdy. Stop looking at that book of yours. Well, now you just hurt my feelings. Hello, 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 hello. hello. Howdy, howdy. What you reading? Ah, uh, it's nothing rude. Howdy, friend. It's something other than that. Ah, so he is rude. Oh! Right. You son of a bitch! Why are you so angry? I'm just an angry guy. No one wanted me as a kid, and even less people want me now. Ah! Help me, my new friend, help! <laughs> well, thank you. Why you have an, uh... Well, it was nice knowing you. What you getting up to? Um... Hi. Howdy, I say, not hi. You do know this is my room, right? I would appreciate it if you'd stop stealing from me. Fine, I'm off now. Thank you. You have a good day now, but not too good. <laughs> this person fucking hates me. <laughs> <laughs> well, mister, from what I hear, you're just not likable, and I can see why you're starting to piss me off, too. Yeah, yeah I see where you're coming from, but uh, it's all a numbers game, really. I mean... If 99% of people don't like you, there's still that 1%, so I figured I'd go to the big city and maybe stop by a bar with a nice group of people. That way, if everyone in the bar hates me except for one, I still come out with one friend. Excuse me, is this another flashback, or are you just going to tell me this time? Yeah, this is another one. We're, we're going to go back into another flashback now. Okay, well, I'll stare off into the distance, too. What are you folks up to or anyways? I've no drink. Just had a poker game, thought we'd have a drink after. Uh, drown your sorrows, I see. I came to play poker once, had nothing but the shirt on my back, and as you can see, I lost that pretty quick. That is one finely combed mustache you have there. Well, thank you, I do appreciate that. I try my best. Hey, how come all you guys are wearing shirts? We didn't lose a poker game. Well, hell, I did, but... Didn't take my shirt off of me. Were you not playing strip poker? Did you not see uh, the sign at front? No shirt, no shoes, no service. Uh, I didn't see that sign at all, but I mean, I have suspenders. That's almost a shirt. It keeps your nips covered. Exactly. They're like sensor bars. Jesus Christ, you can't even stand. All right, you've had enough. Oh, shit. And he's out. I'll take him out. Have fun with the rest of the drunks. Hey, that guy looks like me. How'd that guy get so fat? You see, this was a big mistake, because what I was referring to is that it's very, very difficult to get fat in Red Dead Redemption. I wasn't calling him out. I was genuinely asking how did he do it. I spent days eating crocodile meat trying to get fat, and nothing worked. But obviously... That's not the way he picked it up, and it's his fault for getting offended. The fuck did you just say to me? I said, how do you get so fat? This is all fucking muscle, man. I've never seen muscle jiggle like that. I'm sorry, hey, don't step outside. The wind might blow you away, you scrawny little shit. Well, thank you for looking out for me. I appreciate that. Let me buy you a drink. Oh, wait, you've probably had enough. You know what? If your nose didn't already look like it had been broke three times over, I'd punch you square in the face right now. I think it would just feel like getting hit by some jelly. Let's find out, shall we? Is the fat one in your posse, or is he new as well? Motherfucker, what did you just call me? Uh, shit, I, I know this doesn't sound realistic, but I didn't see you there, as hard as that is to believe. Barkeep, you got any nuts? You can see my nuts if you want. I'm gonna kick you in the nuts if you keep talking. Why are you obsessed with my nuts? Oh, I'm hungry. <laughs> Ain't a surprise. Y'all are just looking to get the fuck out, aren't you? I'm a glutton for punishment, and he's just a glutton. We're a match made in heaven. Motherfucker. 
Polka, what did you just say? Oh about me? shit, he heard me. He's coming back. I'm about to get destroyed. Oh shit, here we go again. Don't pretend you can read. I remember the last book I finished. My hand was cramping after all that coloring. I can see those old pages of blank. Gentlemen, gentlemen, come on, you can both have me. There's no need to fight over me. Ooh, I might take your hat though if you don't mind. That's lovely. Hat thief's a quick way to the hangman's noose, partner. At least I look good in the noose. Should oh fuck, I didn't do nothing! Just relax. Oh, he's cute when he's sleeping. Huh, this hat somehow makes me look worse. Didn't know that was possible. Uh, I didn't either, trust me. That one's actually a bit of an improvement. Yeah, I'm quite fond of this one. Passed through generations of uh, some dude's family that I beat the shit out of. Just put a fucking shirt on. Come on. I'm gonna need something that is elegant, covers me up, but also still shows off my rib cage. Now, I could go on and on about this, but honestly, it was just a repeating cycle of me getting knocked the feck out. Well, mister, I'd just give up if I were you. It seems like just nobody likes it. Oh, my mustache. My mustache is gonna be crooked. Sorry, mister. It's a prosthetic. I lost mine in, in, in the war. Okay, well, let's not speak of that again. What what happened next, mister? What, what you do next? Well, I tried to move on, but honestly, it felt like there was always something hanging over me from that day forward. There was things of the occult, which I couldn't quite explain. Oh, I know what you mean. Sometimes I go into a room and I can't flarn it remember why I went in there. I don't even know what I was going to do. Yeah, kind of like that. Something, something like that. It, it was similar. It was more like getting teleported into a building full of horses, but a uh, similar vein. <laughs> okay, this is fine. Did you get teleported as well? Yep, with my horse. <laughs> 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 oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Just gonna close this drawer before things get out of hand. <laughs> oh, Kevin, open the door. <laughs> I can't open it. <laughs> Wait, why can I buy bitters? You know what? I'm not gonna question anything else. I'll buy these bitters. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? I'm gonna take this condor. I think I've earned it. I say this is my condor. Hey, Kevin, no. <laughs> I'm just standing here with a bird in one hand looking at this disaster. My fucking horse has disappeared. My horse is dead because he's stupid. You wanna see a cool trick coming? Yes. My horse can sidestep. <laughs> Wow, really cool trick. Yeah, I was thinking at this point I wasn't going to catch a break. Once the occult starts going against you, you don't really got no chance. You can't fight nature. You can't fight wizards and witches. So I decided to do what any sane man would do. I picked up my, all my belongings, mainly just my suspenders, and I made my way to the newfound land, Europe, discovered by Christopher Columbus a few weeks back. And I figured a fresh start would do me good. Little did I know what was waiting for me there. Howdy! Oh, what's up, bro? Is this the Americas? We've come all the way from Europe. Oh, it's the natives. I'm gonna try and communicate. Howdy! <laughs> I think they understand me. Do you have meat or guns? I have. Long bagel. I'm so sorry. Is it terminal? So you selling me this horse? Oh. You like my horse? Yeah, load him onto the boat. Oh, don't touch it. Wait, we just take it. <laughs> Jumping on up here. He'll love it. He's got plenty of room to uh to stand. Uh, oh. Oh. <laughs> oh shit. That's perfect. I don't need him alive anyway for what I'm gonna use him for. <laughs> I don't even know how it's standing on. Oh, God. <laughs> oh no. Oh shit, my horse. You sold Did me you faulty me cargo. <laughs> Oh shit. oh shit! That's all good. That's not a bug. That's a oh, feature. Shit. It's just a quirky thing my boat does. <laughs> oh, you love it in Europe. They speak all kinds of funky languages. They say El Howdy over there. <laughs> it's wild. Anyone know which way Europe is? Oh yeah. Oh god, he fell off with his horse. Oh, he's decided to horse his way to Europe. Oh, That's shit. fair. <laughs> By God, As we've reached Europe. Strange. It looks almost like back home. Max, activate lighthouse mode. He's the finest lighthouse I ever hired. He's good, ain't he? France. I thought it would be France, too. That's what I was aiming for, so it kind of worked out. Now remember, they probably don't speak English, and they're going to have a lot of diseases that we ain't used to. Hello, partner. Do you guys speak English? We came all the way from America to your beautiful Europe. It looks... Fantastic. We just got in on a boat. Lost one man. Genuinely don't know where he went. So, uh, whereabouts in Europe are we? 
Hello. Just a language barrier, folks. Give him a second. It's gotta, it's be, gotta France. be France. It's France. They're rude as shit. <laughs> <laughs> ah! That horse is gonna die! Oh my god, I've never god. seen my guy run this fast. Ah, oh, come on. You can't seem to scare horses into water. Isn't that the old saying? You can lead a horse to water, but you can't scare it in. <laughs> I think that's what the saying was. It's oddly specific now that I think about it. I think all our friends left us for some odd reason. <laughs> yeah. Can't imagine why. As I said, little did I know what was waiting for me. More people that don't like me. So I came on back, long story short. And uh, I basically decided to give up on ever having a friend and just going back to my camp and drink some coffee. But little did I know, even that wasn't going to work out for me. Uh, sir, you've been rambling for a few hours now. We're, we're closing. Do you, do you mind paying your tab? No, no, I can't hear you. I'm going into a flashback. Oh. Oh shit, what the fuck? What? I was just drinking my coffee and all of a sudden I was surrounded. That was the worst cup of coffee I ever had. <laughs> all right, that's better. Now, there we go. That was the nicest cup of coffee I ever had. And at that point, I just started to feel like the whole world was against me. Hello? Huh, must have went to uh, fix his mustache or something. Well, now that he's gone, I can lose the hat and the accent. Oh, I'm kind of glad he was gone. Weird looking dude. All right, well, we are going to end the video there. I hope you enjoyed. If you didn't get sick of me already, then I should be live streaming right now. If you're watching this video and it just went up, I should be live right now. I'm going to be doing some uh, Twitch things and we're going to be trying to raise some money for the Make-A-Wish Ireland Foundation. So if you do want to come over, feel free. It's always a good time. Uh, my Twitch channel will be in the description. Uh, if not, no worries. You know, you got stuff going on. I... I I understand. But either way, I hope you did enjoy. I uh, hope to see you next time, folks. I appreciate you watching, as always. But that's about it. Bye for now.